guys welcome back to my channel hello I am Teresa also known as Nina so um call me whatever you want I don't care anyways um it's been a rough weekend we had an earthquake last night oh my god we had an earthquake last night but it was just, it was a 4.0, and I'm not going to say just a 4.0, because it was felt, and it was felt not only in Ohio, but it also branched out to Pennsylvania. So um, it was felt in Cleveland, Geauga, I mean, all over northeastern Ohio. I mean, Facebook was going nuts last night. As soon as it hit, I immediately get uh, a message from my daughter, Daryl Lynn, a message from my daughter to Cora. Um, and they were like, you know, tripping <laughs> and I don't blame them, you know, cause they had their kids and I'm just like, you just make sure my grandkids are okay. Don't y'all worry about me. I can take care of me. You worry about them. It was the same thing when that tornado touched down. I was like calling, get my grandkids downstairs. <laughs> so anyways, um, I'm going to look out for mine, you know, and I don't want them to worry about me. So anyways, um, yeah, that, that, but then we also, I read on, on uh, one of the news channel's websites that we had another one in that morning, but it was a lesser one. And then one like 14 days before that, that was a lesser one. I had no clue about those two. And I don't think many people did. But um, of course, the one last night could not be ignored. It was felt. It shook houses, that's for sure. It had people standing outside wondering what the heck was going on. But see, now you are not supposed to stand outside when there is an earthquake. You just ain't. So, anyways, it's been a rough weekend. Um, bright side, my grandson Reynaldo was here with me as usual. Um, I was hoping to get on here and do a couple of videos, but... The metformin is kicking my butt, guys. Like, I have no energy. I got up for you guys today and got dressed, you know, washed up, did my, you know, everything. And all I did on the weekend was get up, brush my teeth, wash up, put clean pajamas on, and chill in my recliner you know, me and my grandson. And he kept me so I didn't sleep the day away. You know what I mean? Because that's exactly how I felt. And I never feel like that unless I'm like seriously sick. I didn't stay in bed, but it took everything I had to get out of bed. And I certainly did not get out of bed when I was supposed to. I mean, I'm usually up by 830. You know, here I am, 1030, looking at the clock like, uh, I can't get up, you know. So this morning I finally said, that's it. I got to get up. I got to get moving. I got to get dressed today. I've got to do some makeup and a video today. I mean, I just have to. So I did. So here I am. And um, hopefully my body adjusts to the medication. I'm doing everything I'm supposed to. Um, I can only eat like I'm supposed to the best that I can with what I have. You know what I mean? I'm not going to throw everything away. Um, but I am replacing, you know, a lot of my food with better choices for, uh, you know, diabetic choices. We'll put it like that. Oh, and I got my... I got my little um, bag. I have my testing supplies in it. it. says, all my diabetes. Yeah, it's it's a nice size, too. So my, um, my testing kit fits in here. 
and my pill pack where I keep my pouches of my pills for the day. That fits in there. So, I mean, I and I even got tweezers in here. I should put my inhaler in here, my rescue inhaler. And, um, yeah, n now that I've thought of that, I am going to do that when I get off camera. Um, today I am using, again, the Too Faced Palm Springs palette. But I do want to, I believe I said it in the last video, I'm going to use the nice, pretty, metallic pink for my uh, lid. And for my contour, I got the Kenyo on Taveros, uh, what is this called, Beauty Set and Define Kit. So I will use just contour. And I have here the OPV Beauty London Born to Shine Blush Palette, which I love this palette. Beautiful palette, beautiful shades, a little bit of something for everybody, for your skin, different skin tones, for different looks. I mean, that would make a good lid color right there. That it's a pumpkin-y shade. I like it. But, um... Which reminds me, I have my pumpkin spice coffee today. I, and that's, I didn't even drink coffee over the weekend. Now, if I get up and I don't make me some coffee, something's wrong. Because I do not skip my cup of coffee in the morning. I don't care if I have to drink it on my way out the door or wherever I go. I got my coffee. So, with that being said... Um, let's get into my eyes. I think for my lipstick today, I just dropped a brush, I think. Yes, I did. Um, for my lipstick today, I'm going to use Becca Cosmetics. I love Becca. I love this lipstick, and I love how it's, you know, magnetic, beautiful component. Pretty shade. So I do, I do like it. it. Says back on the side there. So I do have that. I'm gonna adjust this down a little bit because I, I know I don't always get everything in view. I don't mean to do that. I mean to get everything in view. Okay, for my Da, 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 da. We're going to go with, oh, I like this. Um, this one's She's Lit. And she's saucy and bossy. Cabana time. I don't have my glasses on, so I, I'm doing the best I can at reading this. But let's see. I'm going to go with Saucy and Bossy. Yeah, see, these are very pigmented. I do, I like Too Faced eyeshadows. I like most of their makeup, but of course, as all makeup, nobody's perfect. And nobody likes the same thing either. So... I don't know why, but my Alexa screen came up. Okay. She's saucy and bossy. I think I'm saucy and bossy when I want to be. In a relationship, nah. I mean... I think it should be 50-50. You know what I mean? We should both be giving it our all, actually. But, um... 
And I'm not going to say if you're not going to give your all, I'm not going to give my all. If you're not going to give your all, I'm done. You know what I mean? What's the sense? There is absolutely no sense in staying in a relationship that you're not happy. You know what I mean? If you're not happy, it's time to go. Um, I know I don't have a lot of room to talk, but I kind of do. Because I can tell you from my experiences... I don't wish my kids away. I'm glad I have them. I'm blessed, God knows. And thank you for my youngest, um, Daryl Lynn and Takora. Uh, they've been so supportive of me, you know, with the diabetes. And I really got to thank them for all of their encouragement. You know what I mean? And their help bringing me my supplies and you know, so forth, and I mean, advice, they both work in the medical field. One's investigational drugs, and the other one is a little bit of everything, but right now she's doing physical therapy. <laughs> I mean, I have four daughters, so, but the twins are the youngest, and although they like to be individuals, there's so much like, so much about them that are alike. And I mean, they both thirst for knowledge and they both keep educating themselves. I mean, like Daryl Lynn, I thought she was never going to be done with college because as soon as she graduates, she's back in doing something else. And it's like, what are you going to do? Okay. You can teach science now. You, you work for home health, um, physical therapy, phlebotomy. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> but, and she even has her own business now with her husband-to-be. They're getting married uh, September September 25th, I believe. I'm excited for them. Um, the, it's, it's a very exciting time for them, to say the least. Um, you know, I'm proud of my kids. Um Aside from that, my daughters are just gorgeous. I wish I had their looks. Well, Elisa looks a lot like me, but she looks a lot like her dad, too. The twins look mostly like me. Amber looks mostly like her dad. Um... You would think my ex-husband's brother and his sister or his or her parents not me and him but anyways um and then you know my friend shannon on here i went to school with her and her mom worked with my mom she's been giving me a lot of helpful advice and so thank you to shannon and congratulations to reynaldo my grandson sleeping in his own bed now. Yay, Reynaldo. I had to put them shout outs out there. You know, when you're proud of your family, you need to say so. You definitely need to say so. And when you have something on your mind, you need to say so. I always say I listen to my heart, but I also listen to common sense. I got to combine the two. You know what I mean? You have to combine the two. I'm deepening the crease now. I have hooded eyes pretty much. Um, I'm going to start practicing on doing wings again. I've, I've tr practiced a little bit in the past and failed. Um, I wish my mom lived here. She could show me. My mom made perfect wings. 
growing up, and I never paid attention to the wings. You know what I mean? She had green eyeshadow, um, which complemented her blue eyes. And she, um, she wore the Great Lash Mascara and the pink tube with the green top. Mm-hmm. I remember all that. Yes, I do. And let's see here. What am I going to... Yes, I did say this pink. Now... It's not going on like I hoped it would. Like the other foils did but it's buildable I just don't want to sit here and build my lids all day my lid color that is um, it goes on pretty smooth at first it felt a little chunky in the pan but it it is pretty smooth it goes on my finger beautifully i don't know if you can see that because the lighting but i like it come over this way a little bit with it and same on this side okay i know i have a tissue somewhere there it is All right, so that looks good. Yeah, my daughter, my oldest daughter, Elisa, posted on Facebook our um, Asheville County covered bridge. It must be a past picture. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's present, but I don't think so yet. The, the shades of color of fall are so gorgeous in the picture. Oh, my goodness. It is such a beautiful picture. I want to get it printed out and mount it, mount it on my wall. It's so beautiful. Mm-hmm. But I, I love fall. Especially the trees and the crisp air and just the sense of fall. Apple orchards. Oh my goodness, apple orchards. Um, my grandmother did not have an apple orchard, but she had a garden like the size of half a football field when she had her home in Madison and she had some apple trees, some grape vines. She had a pond. She had our pig, Susie Q. Till she met her end of days and became food on our table, which was devastating to say the least to me and my sister, Tammy. I think that looks nice. But yeah, um, you know me. I'm going to blend. I'm going to peek in this mirror, make sure. I've got like this dry skin. I don't know if it's from the metformin. And I'm also taking a new medication, Tocor, I think it's called, for my high cholesterol. I still take Lipitor, too. But he added the toe core. So I don't know if they're causing it. I don't know if you can see it. But, you know, I don't filter anything on here. I'm, I'm not going to put myself out there fake. You know what I mean? I am who I am. And I can't change that for you. So, of course, if you don't like 
who I am. Don't watch. <laughs> Move on. I am definitely not perfect. And I'm definitely not a professional. I'm definitely not sane half the time. <laughs> I mean, life just keeps messing with me. But that's okay. Because I always get right back up. And then some. Okay, now, there was some fallout with that. That was the darker shade, doing it under, you know, on my um, bottom lid. So, just so you know, FYI. Well, before I do all this. I need to get my brow a little bit and this side. Okay, well, I'm also going to use my Ofra Gets uh, Rodeo Drive. Uh, some people say Rodeo Drive. I say Rodeo Drive. I don't know what it is, but that's what it is to me. No matter how you say it, I'm going to know what you're talking about. I mean, who doesn't, you know? Now I will blend it a little better. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to fall. I'm already drinking my pumpkin spice coffee and butter pecan. I love it. It's the creamer. I haven't, I don't know if they have butter pecan coffee, but they do have it. The International Delight, they have the cop, the creamer, and I am in love with it. So. Um, I am going to put a little bit of, if I can find it, I pulled my mascara down. I usually don't. I pulled it down so that I could do, there it is. <laughs> I'm like, what the heck? My mascara disappeared. I pulled it down so I wouldn't have to look for it. Well, I don't look for it anyways. It's up here in these two slots. But, um, of course, same old, same old. For now. Till it's gone. I've gotten better about my mascara use. Some people like add a little bit of rubbing alcohol or whatever to get more use out of it, but I don't because that changes the formula. To me, I don't want the formula changed. But everybody has their preferences, you know?
but I like this mascara. Now, if I open a tube of mascara, I'll give it a couple of tries. If I don't like it, I don't keep fiddling with it. I pass it on to whichever grandchild comes first. So I've got some makeup now that I want to pass to whoever I see first. They got to come see me to get it. <laughs> mhm. Mm I'm getting ready. As soon as my body adjusts this medication, I have some sweet potatoes. I want to cook up and make a couple sweet potato pies. My apple pies, my daughter Daryl Lynn came, um, my daughter Decora came, you know, and they took some home to their families. Well, my granddaughter Lily, too, and my grandson um, Reynaldo. I took some pie to my wonderful landlord. Uh, he's a very awesome person. He really is very talented, too. He does paintings and stuff, and he showed them to me one time, and I was just, I love, there's one that he has that I want. It's of a chicken. No, a rooster. A rooster. And I would love to hang that in my living room or my kitchen. I'd say living room. I'm going to put this on now. Glides right on. Of course, it's not transfer proof or anything like a matte lip. Um, that would really be a plus. But um, I like it. Okay. Kenya Antiveros. I hope I'm saying that right. Who knows? I do mess things up sometimes. All right. Of course, we're going with... We got contour, dark contour, and bronzer. I'm just going to hit that contour... Oh, I was going to say ever so lightly. I swear I hit it ever so. I just tapped in it once. I guess I won't have to tap in it no more. Blend it the best I can. That's really. See, that's not so bad now, huh? Some people, and I have. It just depends on how I feel, what I'm doing, what I'm wearing, where I'm going. Everything matters. We have a choice. You always have a choice. And you always have the right to change your mind. But after you make your choice, you know, you're the one that has to live with it. So don't make your choice based on other people. Or just to prove a point. You know what I mean? Don't do that. Because you're cheating yourself when you do that. I know I don't know everything. But I'm telling you, you're cheating yourself when you do that. Because in the long run, you're only hurting yourself. Okay, now... I think I'm going to use this shade on the end here. 
Does it have a name? Smile. My cousin, uh, Shelly, she lives in Pennsylvania. When we were kids and we'd go there, she'd always tell me and my sister, smile, just a little smile for me, please. She's always, she's always had a beautiful heart. I mean, aside from her always being beautiful on the outside, she's beautiful on the inside as well. She had, I think it was chameleons. Yeah, she had some chameleons. We used to like mess, you know, holding and, well, trying to hold. Them little suckers are fast. She this blends in right, really nice. I'm still going to put a little bit across the bridge. Okay. Now that that is done, we will move on to the Ofra Rodeo Drive. I have some other of her highlighters, too. I love, or we'll say I have some more of Oprah, Ofra's um, highlighters. I got some eyeshadows, some blushes. Uh, I'll, I'll get to them on here, I think. I know I have a cart ready for Ulta. Yes, I do. Oh my gosh, they're having a sale. And they're having a 50% off sale every day. There's something different, 50% off. Well, a few things, 50% off, including a couple of fragrances, too. And one of them I have in my cart. Um, I'm trying to think. Uh, there's just so much in Sally Hansen fingernail polishes and her, uh, the Sally Hansen free gift is still available. So the website says. Alta's website, and there's a lot of other nice free gifts with purchases that they're doing. So, I mean, it's worth going on there and looking. They even have uh, a massager, a little electronic device for uh, period cramps that you can place on your lower abdomen, on your back, anywhere you need to. That it's, I don't, I had a hysterectomy, so it's not something I can use. But it is something that might be of interest to all of you. And it, it caught my attention because when my daughter came to pick up my grandson, she said, Mom, do you have my doll? Which I usually do. I know I don't have periods, but I do have grandchildren. I have granddaughters and daughters. So, but every time I get my doll, it disappears. It's like, I can't keep my doll. I've got Tylenol, ibuprofen, I've got headache medication. I mean, everything you can think of, I have it. So, I mean, I've got enough Band-Aids to last me to the end of my life, to be honest. And I rarely use Band-Aids for me, but I bought them because of my grandchildren. I even have pads, tampons, you know, stuff like that. Because they do stay here often. And a couple times somebody's been like, uh-oh, guess what? <laughs> I got a visitor. And I'm not prepared. Well, Nina is. I've always... You know, it was the same thing. Even I think my kids were in kindergarten and I was still taking a diaper bag with me when I went places. Change of clothes, snacks, you know what I mean? Tylenol, thermometer, wipes. In case, you know, we got a mess. Yes, I did. I 
Okay, I think that's good. I'm going to give it a minute to, for the mascara to dry because I forgot to put on my setting spray. And my mascara is not waterproof. So I'm going to avoid my eyes. But... I think that turned out nice. I do. Now, you know, even, even the Morphe setting spray, the continuous setting spray has a light, fresh scent. I would like for everything to be scentless. I mean, one day, hopefully, I will get to show you. Um, I have tons of like skincare, not just for my face, but body skincare, hair care, um, all kinds of stuff. But my thing is, I like to wear fragrances. As in, you know, fragrances. So if I'm wearing a pineapple lotion and I just did a coconut hair mask, and I'm wearing parotta candy, and my makeup smells like chocolate. Mm -mm. And even then, you gotta factor your deodorant in. You know, everything nowadays has some kind of scent to it. And I'm. I'm like, I just want to smell the fragrance that I put on to smell. That's it. But that's it for today, guys. Um, thank you. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for supporting my channel with all of your views. I so much appreciate it. I appreciate them likes, but hey, if you don't like it, you don't like it. Say you don't like it. Um, leave me a comment. I love your comments. I love getting them and answering them. Um, definitely, you know, hit that notification bell if you want to be notified every time I upload a video. It takes like a half hour to upload a video, and I don't know why. I have a really good laptop. But um, when I use my iPad, it uploads a whole lot faster. So obviously, you know, that works faster than my laptop. But I have a hard time with everything else on my iPad as far as doing uploading videos. But anyways, I'm going to practice. I'll go sit in my chair and see what I can do. So if you see a little video that says testing or something like that, you know I'm trying to figure out how to post. See, then I'd be able to show you my shelves of, you know, skincare and hair care products and stuff like that. But I do have quite a bit. I mean, I've seen many people on here who, like, they're, they have a whole room dedicated to their their makeup and skincare. That's not me. But um, half a room. And I have a huge bedroom. I really do. It's It used to be two bedrooms. But the landlord had knocked the wall out and made it one. And I'm so glad he did. Um, but thank you for all of your support. And I really mean that. It means a lot to me. Okay, well, you take care, have a wonderful day, and hopefully I will be here to see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.